Hello, here we are uh, in uh, what used to be Hadim Botanico Churuchaki, near to Tierra Vida Bunchiti. This is Adam Stone and Stone's Guiding. We are here with what they call the uña de gato plant, mm -hmm. or cat's claw in English. This one has been harvested here, but it's starting to come back from its root. Oh, you can see this is, is starting to come back from its root. Here's another sprout right here. You can see it's called cat's claw because it has these claws on it. See that? It's like the claws of a cat, right? See those claws? Now this plant is very medicinal. This plant is very medicinal and we're here in search of this plant because it's especially medicinal for what is an epidemic disease right now in the north called, of, of, from ticks, is called Lyme's disease. This, this plant is great for a lot of tick diseases. Now why do we come this far to uh, find a plant that's good for a, a disease that's in the north? Well, why not? Why would nature not want us, to, why, why nature would want us to connect with the Amazon rainforest, which is the lungs of the earth, in order to save this earth, in order to save ourselves as well? Okay, so this is a very special plant that grows only in the jungle canopies. It loves the jungle canopies, so it's a great plant for, for a sustainable production in the rainforest because it grows underneath the rainforest and it causes a value when you, it's a value added product of the rainforest. So when the rainforest canopy is there, it grows up the trees. You can see the vine? See how it grows up in the canopy of the trees? Now this one has been cut and, and, and harvested here and now it's coming back from its root. So you can harvest it and then it'll keep coming back from its root. If you take care of it, it'll keep growing. Now this bark, what we're gonna do is we're gonna cook this down and this, we're gonna make a great, it's, this is a super, it's been studied a lot in laboratories. It's a super good immune booster. And see these little claws? This is like, your immune system, how it penetrates into the diseases. Now here in the Amazon, the indigenous people have been dealing with parasitic and diseases and pathogens for thousands of years. Thousands of years, the indigenous people have been dealing with pathogens and parasitic uh, uh, diseases. And they're experts at with pathogens and parasitic diseases. So why would they not also be, and their plants not also be experts to parasites and pathogenic diseases that are now plaguing the north, such as Lyme's disease, okay? Now I spent a lot of time out in the woods in the north, right? How come I don't suffer from Lyme's disease? Because I drink a lot of these plants. We've had many patients come, we've had patients come from the north with, with uh, Lyme's disease to Tierra Vida Bunchiti to drink from this vine to be cured from their Lyme disease. You can also drink, when you cut it, it has a liquid in it and it drips down and you can drink that fresh from the tree. These have been cut so they don't have the liquid. But come see, you can see all these coming up from the root. See all these? These will sprout up, climb up and make a and make more, more uh, uh, vines. And what we really want is a big one. We want this fresh, and we'd peel off this bark here when it was fresh, and we'd scrape it and we'd dry it. And that's what's shipped around the world for unidegato cat's claw and sold in capsules. Now I've had the capsules before, and I've also had the fresh bark, and I can tell you the fresh bark is a lot stronger. It's also an intestinal cleanser and it boosts your immune system and it fights the parasites. And like I was saying, the Lyme disease, it encapsulates itself, encapsulates itself inside of a sort of covering like a barnacle. You see this? This reaches inside the one hole that it has inside of its barnacle and whoosh, breaks it open and then your immune system being powered by this plant 
can take care of the Lyme disease and clean your body out. And then you take lots of cleansers like the coconut water. This is the Uye de Gato, cat's claw, grown in the shade of the Amazon rainforest. And here we are with, this is Adam Stone, Stone's guiding in the Amazon rainforest with the cat's claw. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned and watch more of our videos.